Special comment, special comment. I am full and ready. Yes, I'm full of football. Full and ready of football to have it at least 10 months of a year. 10 months of a year. Whether it's XFL, whether it's USFL, whether it's the NFL, I am ready. I am here for it all. That whole entertainment phase, that whole entertainment value, what could possibly go wrong about being entertained by football, the hits, the scoring, the strategic moments of the game, like going forward on fourth down. We doing that now? We doing that now? Good, great. And also, and also, maybe getting a little innovation involved as well. Maybe doing a few things outside of the box. Maybe testing the waters to see if there's an appetite for something different, something new, something basically strange. Everybody likes the strange. A couple of us admit it. The rest of us lie about it. The strange is amazing. The strange is entertaining. The strange is new, the new, new. The strange is something that you, you see and you fantasize about. Sorry, uh, fantasy football peeps, but I'm talking about the real life fantasy, the reality fantasy, not the actual fantasy fantasy where it's make believes rainbows butterflies and all that stuff but not to say anything's wrong with rainbows and butterflies in fact if i could find and have rainbows i would and i go to the end of it knowing knowing goodness well there's a happy surprise waiting for me at the end of a rainbow but butterflies they're just magical. Butterflies, there's something different. There's the transformation that they go through going from one entity, one something to something completely different. And that is a metaphor for football. You NFL, yeah, you can go to something different. You can just blossom. You can just blow yourself up, but in a good way. That new, new, that newness, that different, that strange, and having a partnership with the XFL, letting them be the crash dummies, but not in a derogatory way, not in a nefarious way, not in a negative connotation. So how about I put it this way? How about I change it up and say it like this? Having the XFL be your test subjects on rules and different ideas that you would like to and want to come across which you would like to implement and even you usl usfl doing a little bit new stuff and different stuff you can allow other leagues to take those ideas and take those methods and take those regulations and everything else and run with it it can be an intertwined woven together kind of symbiosis relationship where it's mutual and is not just beneficial to one party or one league they're all going to grow. They all can eat. There's enough food on the table. There's enough food on the table so nobody's left hungry. How? How? Ever. That entertainment got to be on point. There's enough food on the table to eat. But there ain't enough eyeballs. There ain't enough creativity. There ain't enough minds to keep attention with. So whatever you are thinking about doing, go ahead and level that up 1.1 billion, a billy. Go ahead and level it up to that. I see. I didn't say trillion, cause I want to. I want to keep the. I want to keep the numbers and the the, the factors in a realistic realm. I don't want to take this into a hyperbole town. I don't want to go down that rabbit hole. 
And especially if you're going down my rabbit hole and I'm leading you there, I'm leading you there because the food is delicious. I'm leading you there because it's an amazing place where you want to be and where you would like to end up. Not to his logical conclusion, because who does that? Who would like to and who would want to do that? Sober. But leading, doing things where it's the new, new and having these ideas, bringing them to the forefront and allowing the leagues to use, utilize that and run with it and make the game better and make the game fun, make the game more entertaining without actually losing your core principles, without actually losing what made the league the league so you can implement it any form of fashion how you want to but you already have an idea and you already know that it's going to work it's called being strategic it's called running tests it's called the scientific method how about that for the final last answer and having this sport 10 months out of 12 ain't a bad thing nothing can be wrong with more nothing can be wrong with more if there's quality in more if there's something that's entertaining and attractive with more and the more is different it's not necessarily the same you have enough time you can make time for something that you have value for you create that value you can do whatever you want to do wait a minute within the realm of not necessarily being completely evil you can make that money make that money do the advertisements and all that stuff i'm cool i'm good with it because i like and i want to see you succeed and grow while at the same time, not off the backs of those who cannot, those who are unable, that's where I draw the line. But outside of that, go for it, do it. You want to open up or start a league in different parts of the world and places, do it. What's stopping you? test it out and if it works it works go ahead move forward with it if you want to add more games go ahead move forward with it if you want to make instant replay or challenging any and every kind of play if it makes sense do it there is something about getting this right there's something about making it more better and there's also the thing where is it has to bring value there's no point of uh putting something out there that's half cocked there's no point of putting something out there that's half baked we all know how we move around out here ain't nobody gonna bake the rest ain't nobody gonna bake the rest in fact we're all headline readers what the story say I don't know. I just read the headline. The headline made me upset. But it was nothing about the story. I don't care. The headline's true. Because it says it's true. We know how that works. We know how that ends. And I'm not taking you down that road, that yellow brick road, because it ain't paved in go. It is paved in cobblestone. And we don't do cobblestone walking here. We're a little bit bougie. We are a little bit bougie. And as you can see, I got my serious spectacles on and I'm keeping it super serious. It is super duper serious. And that's why having football, American football, if you will, if you are confused and don't understand, well, I'm going to make you understand it can and it should be about 12 months or 10 months out of 12 12 months is a little bit too long but 10 and you can 
have one league playing at this time and then maybe they overlap within the middle and another league starts up and playing at another time 24 7 365 minus the 60 or so days to make it 10 months what could possibly go wrong that is one of the bestest idea that i took actual thought into coming up with that i took many many sleepless and restless nights trying to figure out the end game that's the end game game over Sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.